The quest for wild and mysterious beings is often associated with distant, exotic lands like South America, Africa, and the Pacific Northwest of the United States. However, tales of such creatures in the UK might indeed raise eyebrows. Yet delve into the legends, and you'll find a tapestry of folklore that is as intriguing as it is unexpected. In the heart of Dorset's folklore lie the Woodwooses, or wild men, who purportedly inhabited the forests near Dorchester's Yellowham Hill. These enigmatic beings were said to have a penchant for abducting girls from nearby villages, leading to whispers of pregnancies resulting from their encounters. The tales are as fantastical as they are perplexing, leaving one to ponder the possibility of their existence in the dense forests of Dorset even today. Skeptics may dismiss these stories as mere flights of fancy or elaborate schemes to conceal more mundane affairs. However, the notion persists. Could the Woodwooses have been real, primal beings who once roamed the British Isles? The debate rages on, fueled by encounters and anecdotes passed down through the ages. The accounts take a chilling turn with the eerie incidents of 1910, involving Dr. A. Helby and a young British Army captain. Both met tragic ends on a desolate stretch of road, their encounters shrouded in mystery and whispers of hairy hands leading them astray. Even the quaint village of Orford boasts its share of peculiarities, with historical records dating back to King Henry I.E.'s era recounting encounters with wild men ensnared by fishermen's nets. The tales paint a vivid picture of beings that straddle the line between human and beast, leaving an indelible mark on local lore. Devon and Cornwall add their own chapters to the saga, with tales of lawless existence and primitive lifestyles intertwined with stories of cannibals and thieves. These narratives blur the boundaries of reality, leaving us to ponder the thin veil separating fact from fiction. Yet the stories don't end there. From Bigfoot to Littlefoot, British folklore is replete with encounters with beings both large and small. Welsh legend speaks of the Bubash, diminutive creatures with a penchant for household chores and a deep disdain for teetotalers. Even in modern times, sightings of enigmatic creatures continue to captivate the imagination. The 1999 sighting of a baboon-like creature near Prestwick Airport adds a contemporary twist to age-old tales of the unknown. In the face of skepticism, believers maintain that these encounters hint at a paranormal realm lurking just beyond the veil of reality. Yet, in a land as densely populated and industrialized as Britain, the existence of such beings seems improbable. Regardless, the allure of the British wild man legend endures, beckoning us to explore the depths of history, folklore, and the mysteries that shroud the landscapes of the UK.